Alright y'all, I have been asked to show how I put these rods in. So because I love y'all, I'm willing to go through the process again. The long and tedious process ain't that bad. Um, a little white residue you see. It's going to be going by the time I get under the dryer. Well, put the dryer to my head. My head is not going to fit on the dryer list. See, this is all of it so far. What do I have in? Again, my onion honey hemp conditioner. Also, you know what I'm using right now, too? In addition to the... Where is it? My organic loop simulator, like a twist gel. I'm also using a little weed at climate control. Yeah. It's about that time. Okay. So here we go. Here we go. I think we should have put a clip in. I already have the conditioner left in, in my hair. So what I'm going to do is take a little bit of this. Is that my sister ringing the doorbell? Let me tell you, she called me talking about she wanted a tuna fish sandwich. I said, well, you need to call a deli. This is not the deli. And then she has a cat. She has two cats, Midnight and Savannah. And one of them was playing in her yarn. The cat I met with the whole thing of yarn. Bad cats. All right, so I got the climate control. Now I'm taking a little of the organic stimulator smoothing that in combing it through I guess I hope you can see now keep it smooth keep it smooth this happens to be the smoother part of my hair but I mean the smoother you can keep the better now you gotta make sure you're putting these on the right side Yes, it makes a difference. If you put it on the wrong side, it's going to start going weird. So, yeah. All right. I hope you can see. All right. So what we're going to do is, hope you can see. Yeah, smooth it around. Damn. Can you see? I'm sorry. All right. Just smooth it around. Keep it smooth. Smooth it with your fingers if you need to. See? Smooth with my fingers. Then you're going to roll a little bit at the ends. And then you're going to go to the side. Smooth if you need to. Go up, up, up. Moderate tension. I'm at the root. Just pull it tightly enough. Now take, like right where it's here. And bend over so it's like that. And it's gonna stay. See, it's not hard. Admittedly, damn, this looks a little. Oh, that got a little loose up there. Okay. Wait a minute. I have to bend this one in the opposite direction. This is what I mean. These. And now it should stay. There we go, see? These take some practice. They take a little practice, but they're not... It's not hard. Damn, you see all my grays? Oh, Jesus. Like I said, the more you do these, the better you get. I actually did something a little bit different. Let's go around. Show you. Oh my god, this one takes me back to Chris Annabelle's parties. The freaking dopest DJ. Shout out to Chris Annabelle. Holding it down with Apple Kinetic. See, I think I'm about to do it on the wrong side. Am I? Damn, I'm 
can't do it so you can see. No, it's the right side. Right, I think, yeah. Okay. Oh. You can space them out more if you want to. And it's flat against my roots. And over we go. And we're going to stay in the place. Okay, this is what I was doing. Damn, damn, this one came a little bit unraveled. Just a little bit. I just move it down. No big deal. No biggie. Okay. If you would get out of my way. All right. This outer piece. I figured doing them in the opposite direction makes it lay down better. So I'm going to show you. I felt like somebody was walking behind me. Mm -hmm. I told you this is the part of my head that like like right up here. doesn't particularly curl. And this one reminds me of another DJ, DJ Kato. Another dope DJ, dope parties. Okay, we're gonna do the opposite on this one. So, because it's gonna lay more taut at the root, so I'm just gonna go opposite, wind around like so. Wind around a bit there and then go smooth it. I'm trying to smooth it. Okay. I'm going to go up. Now you see what I mean? Okay. I want this to lay, I want my meat to lay flat. Alright. There we go. Well, I mean, it's going to be kind of puffy anyway, but, you know, and <laughs> let me tell you something. It's nothing that some bobby pins can't cure. So while it's going to look kind of stupid, I mean, who am I profiling for at home? It's no big deal. All right, I'm going to do the, I'm going to do this last part first. Because my nephew's here now. I hear him downstairs. He's going to come up. For Shay! No, he's going to call me. Sh he's going to say Shay Shay. Shay Shay, you gonna run up here, I'm telling you. Now, I don't know how many rods I use this time. I ain't gonna lie. I think I used slightly more than last time, so. I use my Lush products, but you're gonna see the review on that. Mm. My hair smells interesting right now. Can you see? Can you see? I hope. Smooth it. Okay. Sometimes you, well, I've seen, you know, sometimes you may use a spray bottle if you want to keep your hair damp. And this is a tight enough hair. There we go. Oh well. I don't care. Whatever. 
Um, what I find is that the climate control is more of a wet gel, so I really don't need to use any, you know, spritz or such. I'll wet it down just, just enough. Time, but it's not gonna lay down, so that's no big deal. <laughs> now, see, you see this fuzz? You see that fuzz? Let me tell you something only eco style attains that right there. Try to smooth it down a little something, something. Flyaways, just smooth it down, and make sure you're going in the right direction. Okay, that's it. Not too hard. It's you know what? It's more work. I gotta rinse this gel off my hands. It's more work when you're doing the um oh wow, cleavage. <laughs> it's more work when you're doing small rods. Um I will never in my life use small rods again. Just too much damn work. This one's trying to come undone. No problem. My hands is my hands are wet. I'll just smooth, smooth it down. I mean, it may not be perfect, but you know what? Who gives a rat's butt? You gonna look fly no matter what you do, cause y'all are all fly ladies and gents. Whoever's watching. You are fly no matter what. Okay. Jeez, I got gel in my nails. All right. Yeah. Hope this helps. Hit me up if you have any questions. I still have more gel in my hands. I'm sorry. I don't want to touch the camera when my hands work though. Okay. Yeah, I know I'm clumsy. I didn't drop anything, guys. Oh my god. You know how I always drop some. Well, I guess I did drop enough stuff while I was in my room. Mm hmm Yeah. So let's not break it. And we'll just end the video here. Peace.